I'm Professor Hindi Nyman, the Oriel and Lang Professor of the Interpretation of Holy Scripture at Oriel College at the University of Oxford. Um, our, our program um, and uh, our program hosts a variety of students who work anywhere from the Hebrew Bible in its ancient Near Eastern context to working on the Hebrew Bible and text criticism, Hebrew Bible and early biblical interpretation, as well as particular interest in the growth of composition and interpretation of the Hebrew Bible from the earliest stages of the biblical materials themselves through Qumran, Cairo Geniza, Midrash, early Christianity, and beyond. This is a program that hosts a number of different seminars, and I want to highlight two. The first is the Old Testament seminar, where we meet weekly, discuss new research by senior scholars and postgraduates on the study of Hebrew Bible and the Old Testament um, across linguistic registers, um, Hebrew, Greek, Syriac, Latin, um, and Ethiopic, as well as thinking, um, as well as thinking creatively with scholars of patristics, of Midrash, and medieval Jewish and early Christian manuscripts. I also host another seminar called Early Biblical Interpretation, which meets on Thursdays, where we look at biblical and extra-biblical materials and the history of interpretation of those texts across centuries and across a variety of distinctive interpretive communities. It's a very, very exciting time in Oxford. We've just launched a new Center for the Study of the Bible and the Humanities, which collaborates intimately um, across each term with the Center of Hebrew and Jewish Studies at Oxford, the Clarendon Institute, located on Walton Street. We host our seminars in the, for the Old Testament and Hebrew Bible, either um, in Jewish Studies, the Clarendon Institute, or um, at Oriel, um, in Oriel College. Um, our undergraduate courses are typically held in the Gibson Building, the Faculty of Theology and Religion, or in Oriental Studies. We've just um, this year hired a new Biblical Hebrew lecturer, Dr. Alinda Damsma, who joins us from London, having done um, her, her doctoral work in the Netherlands, and more recently her postdoctoral work in Cambridge, and recently has been lecturing in London. Um, in addition, in addition to Alinda, um, the new Regis Professor of Hebrew is Professor Jan Yosten. Um, and myself, we have a new and exciting team along with existing post holders and college fellows. The center of my research focuses on questions of authenticity, attribution, pseudepigraphy, and composition. I'm interested in how the biblical books came to be what they are, how they grew within the Bible and beyond the Bible, how the Dead Sea Scrolls complicate, interrogate, and problematize the canon as we know it, and how the vitality and growth of the biblical tradition already started from our earliest stages of biblical writing, collection, and assembly, whether it's wisdom texts, prophecy books, or law. My current projects involve two books, one called Biblical Reading, where I consider philosophical and literary models for understanding the interpretation, the history, the authorship, and the growth of biblical composition in Jewish antiquity. In addition to that, I'm writing a book called Vitality of Scripture, where I consider traditions of wisdom, traditions of angels, and traditions of prophecy and lament as ways of understanding the precursors to the development of later biblical interpretation, as well as subsequent accounts of growth, composition, and vitality of biblical tradition well beyond the biblical period. The Bible is important for Western civilization, for the humanities broadly conceived, as well as for understanding the Western classical tradition. The field of biblical studies interests me also with respect to the history of scholarship, its formation in conversation with the field of classics, as well as the emergence of New Testament rabbinics and early Christianity. Our seminar meets every week across the year. We invite students, we invite senior scholars from around the world, from Israel, from England, from our own faculty in Oxford, as well as colleagues that visit us as from places as far away as Canada, the United States, and across Europe to come and share their new, exciting research with us and help us think with them about the field-changing developments of Hebrew Bible. 
The graduate student workshops afford every postgraduate, both at the master's and the doctoral levels, from theology and religion, from Oriental studies, as well as students who work in later forms of Jewish antiquity, to come present their new research and engage faculty and students alike as they refine, write, publish, and present their work around the world. We're delighted to boast a program and weekly meetings that engage between 40 and 45 people, um, as well as students and faculty members from departments and from intellectual communities well beyond theology and religion across Oxford. This coming year, we will have a collaborative Old Testament Hebrew Bible program together with our colleagues at Cambridge, where we'll explore translation and interpretation as a organizing theme for students and faculty alike, and where we'll share the space of Oxford on the one hand and Cambridge on the other. In Hillary term of this year, our theme is innovation and ritual. We will bring scholars from the Hebrew University, from Helsinki, from the United States and Canada to come together and think about the Hebrew Bible ritual innovation and practices in a comparative context as well as within the history of the development of the Hebrew Bible. In Trinity term of this coming year, in 2018, on June 4th, I will be co-running a workshop with Professor John Barton on wisdom and ethics, which will run the full day um, and incorporate um, research from scholars across the UK as well as postgraduate students within Oxford and beyond. My current center, the Center for the Study of the Bible and the Humanities, creates a home for scholars and students to gather together and think across disciplines such as philosophy, literature, history, theology, religion, and Oriental studies. The center aspires to be a home for scholars and postgraduates who are interested in the study of the Bible in the humanities to come together and create new field-defining work, raise new questions, create new research projects, and think together about the place of the Bible in the university.